if it's authentically COVID-19 as the media puts it, there is still an event that we are all tuned into and this, this harmonizes our vibration together and this will, we will come out of this in tune. So it's very, very important that we are all resonating with the future of our dreams. And so we are so excited to talk to you about what we have been doing and what, what we're doing with the Holistic Justice League and to present to you how, how you can get involved or uh, be a part of the tribe. So with me, uh, my name is Ra and with me is Seema here. And she's, uh, she's an architect and I've always known her as an architect. I've known her for about a decade. She's basically good at every single thing that she does. Mm. And uh, yeah, she's got some really fancy buildings up here in LA in Santa Monica Museum, the Broad Museum, a brand new museum in downtown LA. She had part in the design on that. And she's architected the Holistic Justice League about a year and a half ago. And it's growing and we are doing really exciting stuff. We've got a big mission, we've got a big why. And so we're going to present what we're doing right here. Yeah, thank you everyone for taking the time and stepping on this call. We're all about education and knowledge because that's the antidote to fear and to disease. Really educating and, and having the knowledge that it takes to feel strong, to feel centered. And this is why the Holistic Justice League was founded. Um, it was a bunch of us that came together a year and a half ago, and we decided to start sharing this mission of ending human suffering, because all of our suffering starts in our gut with our food supply, starts with our friendships, our community. And we have a very simple message, and the message is that uh, we want 100% organic, whole food nutrition, high density nutrition in everyone's bodies. For that, it's very simple. We created a mission, right? That's our message. Our mission is, is really coming back to the basics and it's our responsibility to protect our families. It's our responsibility to connect with one another now more than ever. And we need to recognize that the only power we hold for ourselves is the absolute truth that we're humans and we require whole food nutrition. So, what everyone here in the Holistic Justice League is, is stepping for is farm to family, bringing back real food to everyone's body. And our movement is not a trend. We're not here to promote um, a diet. We're not here to promote being vegan or being paleo or anything. We're here to promote um, real food. This is a real food revolution. And by a revolution, I mean, the way that our communities are feeling today. How is our family feeling? How is you know, our loved ones feeling? What we want is a shift in consciousness, a little shift in consciousness in everyone to start questioning what do we put in our body? Start questioning, am I having artificial ingredients, pesticides, herbicides, glyphosate, plastic, every single human, it's being proven, eats about a credit card amount of plastic every week. So that's a lot of plastic that we're putting into our bodies, right? So what we want is our communities to feel great, to feel amazing. And who can relate to wanting to feel awesome? So, so what the Holistic <laughs> Justice League is, it's a virtual community, okay? Mm -hmm. And as we look into this world, who are still working? The essential workers are still working, right? And an essential uh, business is getting food to the people. And when we look at the world, maybe we were over consuming, right? When we look at all the, the issues, if issues exist, if we want to look at it from that paradigm, maybe we were over consuming and now is the time where we're back to basics. And we're, like I said earlier, we're harmonizing with this. And so when we look at like, what is the basics of a community? We got food, right? And the food is all about getting life source into the body, right? Our food, our, the plants are made up of a combination of light, earth, air, and water, and consciousness, okay? So you put all of that into you, that's what's making us operate. That is an essential nutrient that we need. Mm -hmm. And then we, there's, there's other necessary items for a community. So the Holistic Justice League, as I said, is a virtual community. We're feeding people. We're providing people way out of the nine to five matrix. Now, everybody's job has pretty much dissolved. 
Maybe you had a job doing something not essential for the human race. Now is the time where we can get a job, a, a business, where we're providing an essential nutrient to the planet. And then we're also providing community, a community based on self-development and personal development and business development. So it's developmenting people, giving people a way where they can make an income and provide an income to uh, their, their networks and feeding people. So that's the three components we're gonna talk about here. And that's the essence of the Holistic Justice League. So on to food. Exactly, like, like Raj just said, we're here to talk about where we're going. Where is our community? Where is our health going? Not about the past. We're only focused on what's happening from now on. So we're partners with a lifestyle transformation and this company, it's incredible. It's aligned with our values and this is why we jumped on board and they provide organic whole food nutrition and that's what we want. So we're here to talk about five superfoods that can change your life. And these superfoods, as a matter of fact, it was passed on uh, from Dave Sandoval. He's the founder. He worked with Ann Wigmore. She's the founder of the Hippocrates Institute of Healing Cancer with Wheatgrass. And before she passed away, she told Dave Sandoval the secret to longevity. And it's very simple. In order to extend our life by 45%, we need to nourish ourselves, we need to detoxify, and we need to replenish. And repair, sorry, repair. So detoxify, nourish, and repair. If we can be doing these three things in a cycle, we are extending our life by a huge chunk because eating organic is not enough, especially nowadays. Uh, there's farms that have certified organic certified labels, and they're next to an, uh, a farm that is being sprayed with glyphosate, and glyphosate goes in the air, so it's actually polluted. So we're going to talk about the first superfood, which is the power shake. The power shake is actually this one. And we have now new packaging. Everything is gonna be packaged on biodegradable hand packages because we're going 100% plastic free. We're one of the only companies in the world that would have a zero carbon footprint. That's incredible, guys. Which other company do you know? Drop a one in the chat if you know of a company that is 100% plastic free, and it has zero impact on the environment. Because we can only be as healthy as our environment. We can't be healthier than our oceans full of plastic, and we can be healthier than our soils depleted of nutrition. So I see no one dropped a one, because I don't know of another company that's 100% plastic free. So that's what we're aligned with Purium. It's because we're the first company of this size to figure out the biodegradable packaging so this company called purium which stands for pure and pure premium is decades ahead of of the rest of the companies it's what's designing the organic standards in this country and many other countries exactly so the power shake it's the famous liquid sunshine that we're all sharing and the reason that we share it it's because Two scoops in water, it provides all the vitamins and minerals that our body needs to thrive. The foods that we're intaking right now, they have this amount of nutrition because they're planted in soils that don't have any minerals. So imagine if your soils don't have minerals, how much minerals does your piece of broccoli has, right? And, and, um, our farms are in Utah, 6,000 feet elevation. You want to share about the farms? Mm -hmm. She just keeps good at that. Yeah, so we've, we've, our internet connection is unstable. If you guys can't hear us, just unmute yourself and let us know, please. So this company has about 70 products, and we're explaining pretty much our number one product, the product that we share with everybody. It's a 30-day program. It consists of five different products. So it's a little set. It's a little package, and it's essentially food. And the way that we use it and all of our friends use it is we're consuming these five products all day long with some other ones, but we're not really going to talk about those. But we consume these five products every single day and we eat about once or twice a day. So the first one's the power shake and, and it's, and then I'm going to explain how the juices get turned from wheatgrass to powder and it's special wheatgrass too. It's kamut wheatgrass, which is uh so this, these seeds were found in Egyptian tombs. So uh, in Utah, we're, we've got these farms and they're on dried lake beds, okay? So next to a volcano. 
So that volcano was spewing ash on this lake for thousands or hundreds of thousands of years, and the lake dried up about 100 years ago. And then we put a farm on this, on this lake bed, and there's not been another farm on the lake bed, and there's about 90 feet of volcanic ash, and that's what we're growing this wheatgrass on. And then we take the wheatgrass and we, we juice it in these giant masticators. What happened? Nothing. Okay. All right. So I'm assuming everyone can still see me. Something happened on our screen. We juice, we juice the juice in these giant masticators. Are we good? All right. And then that juice gets sprayed in a very fine mist at the top. This is it. This is what we have. We're not making any more. Let's mute everyone. We can hear you. <laughs> now you're good. I'm going to start over on the, the juice. So we're juicing the wheatgrass. Wheatgrass turns into juice. Then the juice gets pumped to the top of these silos that are about 150 feet. The juice gets misted in these silos. And there's fans aligning the silos. And as the juice falls, the fans blow up room temperature air. So I mentioned that this company is doing many firsts. One of the first, another first is that we're powdering juices at room temperature. We're using no heat above 78 degrees. So, hi solar, <laughs> our dog solar. So this, this powder is basically still fresh and still raw and it's still considered food. All the enzymes are in it and that's why we actually feel and take this powder like it's food and I actually haven't had a salad in a year and a half and I used to eat salads for breakfast so uh, I used to eat them a lot and I haven't felt like I needed raw greens since consuming the power shake yeah so that's the first superfood it's all about nourishing the second one it's our super amino 23s and it's this one the super amino 23s is literally the best protein that I know in the planet it's super amino acids it's chain acids so this protein was designed for patients in the hospitals that had stomach cancer and had their stomachs removed. So these people would lay down in hospital beds for months without a stomach and they had to receive protein. So this is the eight essential amino acids that our body needs to produce and to make muscle, muscle fiber. And it doesn't have to be digested because our gut doesn't need to digest this pre-digested, which means that our gut doesn't have to spend any energy at all to process this protein. And Ross, an expert at describing this one. I used to be in yeah. the gym industry. I used to own several gyms in downtown LA and amino acids are something that's normal in the, in the, the gym bag of many people that go to the gym. And usually they're sold as branch chain amino acids. And that means there's three amino acids, three of the essential amino acids. There's actually nine total. And in here is eight because the ninth one we pretty much get mm -hmm. in, in plentiful amounts in our diet and you get too much, it's toxic. So this has all nine. And as Seema said, they're designed for hospital patients to go in the IVs, even people that are, that are having kidney failure where they can't process protein sources Protein breaks down into amino acids and amino acids come in a very geometrical shape and they go around your body and your cells use them to, to make and to do a lot of processes in the body. So they're essentially critical for the human body. Mm -hmm. And these are basically 99% absorbable because they're already in the amino acid format. When you eat a protein source, whether it's meat, whether it's animal or plant, your body has to spend energy to break it down and there's waste created. So with this, there's essentially 1% waste as opposed to like 60% waste from eating animal products or 40% waste from eating spirulina. This is 99% absorbable and this will build muscle on you whether you work out or not. And with these products, we can actually fast like 600 to 800 calories a day and gain muscle, which is crazy it's crazy and it's the reason why a lot of our transformations look impossible exactly so imagine when you eat meat chicken or beef or isolated protein your body only absorbs from 17 to 40 percent of that protein the rest gets lost in your digestion process so you're not actually absorbing all the protein that you think that you're eating 
because it doesn't have a utilization rate uh, to full potential. This has 99.9 .9 utilization rate. That, that's why your body absorbs absolutely all the protein that you take with the amino acids. Basically, it's the only thing on the market like it. Yeah. Another, yeah. another thing. And our, our, gut, our gut works so hard to digest meats all day long that when you do take this vegan pre-digested protein, you immediately notice that there's not gut inflammation. There's no digestion problems because your gut is getting everything that it needs to be happy and it's already pre-digested as we said. Then the next superfood, it's one of my favorites and it's purely all antioxidants. One tablespoon of this apothe cherry, if you guys can see, it's pure cherry concentrate. You're in the and we, we opened it last night because we take it before we go to sleep. Um, cherries are the only source in nature that induces our body to produce its own melatonin. So if you're living in the city, if you have 5G exposure, if you have blue light, if you live in a building with tons of Wi-Fi or street lights that's affecting our hormones, especially our melatonin production to fall asleep, we recommend that you do take pure cherry concentrate with no, no water filling, just pure. And one tablespoon of this apothe cherry is equivalent to having 20 cups of blueberries. That's how many antioxidants there is in one tablespoon. Uh, the other thing is when you are in an, when you're not taking antioxidants, you're in an oxidizing diet right? Because you're not eating antioxidants. And how many of you guys eat at least one serving of fruit a day to have enough antioxidants? If you're not, then you're oxidizing because you're in an oxidizing diet. And what happens when batteries oxidize? When happen, what happens to anything when you oxidize? It just doesn't work anymore. It ages, it gets old and rusty. And same thing with our body. We age, we create more wrinkles, we just age at a faster speed. So having antioxidants is super important for longevity, for you to look fresh. I have a lot of girls that instead of going to get Botox or all these surgeries to look younger, they just drink these bottles, you know, a couple a month to have enough antioxidants in their, in their, in their body. And there that's actually what, uh, radiation is doing so you imagine a microwave it's radiating the little water cells it's shaking them it's causing free radicals in our body so we're, whether we're talking about emf from electrical cables by your bed or actual 5g the mm -hmm. the free radical count in your body is increasing due to these emf fields mm -hmm. and the way to mitigate the risk of of the 5g is to make sure that you have antioxidants in your body that are neutralizing the free radicals. And so the ORAC value on this is extremely high. As you said, it has as much antioxidants as 20 servings of blueberries. And that's this tart cherry blend specifically. Tart cherry is also something I've taken for the last 15 years because it's got, it's got potential for healing the body after extreme exercise. This is super thick stuff super concentrated, also not GMO at all. We get these cherries specifically from Italy, which is a very anti-GMO country. All the cherry farms in America are pretty much owned by Coca-Cola. A lot of the organic industry in America are owned by corporations. Many of you guys know that. Uh, it's, all, it's all getting kind of whitewashed and or watered down is what I meant to say. Yeah, actually, uh, Dave Sandoval told us a little analogy about the free radicals. So a free radical is a toxin in your body, right? So imagine that, imagine a party when there's a bunch of couples, you know, in happy and harmony. And then this is a single guy walking into the room and try to break the couples apart and separate them and create chaos, right? So that's a free radical. It's a metal, it's a toxin that is coming into its cells that are working in harmony and it tries to break them apart and create disease. And once one cell gets broken apart, it's missing apart and then it goes searching from the next cell and it's a giant chain reaction. Yeah. 
And if you guys notice, if you go to Walgreens or any drugstore, everything has cherry flavor, right? Everything that is a flu remedy or medicine in any drugstore would have the cherry flavor. And that's because cherries are so high in antioxidants that they heal our body a lot faster. And then the next superfood that I want to talk about, it's our best, best product in Purium, and it's called Biomedic. Biomedic is actually the only product in the market that has been proven to pull out up to 74% of the glyphosate in our gut. If you don't know what glyphosate is, is this herbicide that's being sprayed in our crops. If you ever eat in anything that is not organic, which is 100% all, all of us, we have 100% chances of having glyphosate in our gut. Glyphosate destroys our microbiome and it doesn't absorb, it doesn't allow our gut to absorb vitamins and minerals. So imagine your gut, your stomach has a lining and this lining has all these little hairs, right? The villi. And these little hairs absorb vitamins and minerals when we eat. So if we eat a strawberry, these little hairs are like, oh, here's vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin C. And it brings it to the bloodstream and the blood takes it to the rest of our body for healing. Now, when we have glyphosate in our gut, these little hairs get all glued together, right? And this is how we start creating leaky gut. And these hairs are glued by a layer of glyphosate. Imagine the layer of wax in your gut. And it has all these little hairs glued. Immediately, when these hairs can work, they start to open up and this is what creates leaky gut. And now there's food and there's toxins that haven't been digested going straight into your blood. And feces. And yeah, all kinds of stuff that you don't wanna know. And this is why people get so sick with autoimmune diseases. This is why no one can lose weight or drop weight, even though they've been eating salads and working out for five years. It's just because their gut doesn't have the capability to absorb nutrition. And when that happens, guess what? All of your hormones are out of balance. Your thyroid, your adrenals, everything is out of whack and we can heal. So glyphosate is being proven to be a carcinogen it causes cancer and it causes all the gut and even our happiness is being taken away by Monsanto and, and glyphosate. Because what defines and what emotions and in what mood we're gonna be on every single day is our serotonin production in our gut. So if we don't have healthy serotonin, guess what? We're depressed, we're stressed out, we're angry, we have bad relationships. Everything goes wrong when we are disrupting this connection between our gut and our brain our gut is a brain actually mm -hmm. and so i mentioned earlier that that the way that we function is getting energy and chi and ki or prana whatever you want to call it even god into the body and that's a combination of those things light air water earth and ether or consciousness and that's mm -hmm. all happening in the gut now in the gut lining your intestines is neurons. There's neurons also in the brain also. This is proven science. There's neurons in, in the gut. And imagine this is where the vital nutrition comes into the body. And this is where the body then assimilates all of those elements into you. So it makes sense that there's a brain in the gut that's basically looking at what you, the energy, the life force that you're bringing into yourself. And it's saying, okay, this, I need to make this into rock. So I'm going to, uh, I, the, the gut needs to think about these things. Now this brain, if it malfunctions, is gonna start making you maybe crave things and maybe be addicted. If there's, if, there's, if there's malfunction in the gut, you might also not be able to think properly. Maybe you get addicted to certain emotions based on the food that you're eating or based on the, the, the silent killer roundup. Mm -hmm. So we were in Home Depot the other day and we found, we were actually, we are just next to the roundup because that's where the cardboard boxes were. And when you flip the roundup container over, which is what Monsanto basically uh, makes roundup and glyphosate, as she was saying, that, that word is the active ingredient in roundup. And when you flip the roundup container around, it says right in the corner, this destroys an enzyme it, that is not in human beings. This destroys an enzyme that's in plants and pests that is not in human beings. It's like <laughs> saying it with like in yellow print, like this is the awesome thing that destroys the enzyme, but you guys don't have the enzyme. That's correct.
but the way that our gut works is that there's there's a there's a beneficial relationship with a lot of bacteria in our gut and that bacteria breaks down our food and it's actually necessary for those villi mm -hmm. to operate properly and those villi to even grow so there's bacteria that's necessary for your villi that grab the nutrients out of your food it's necessary for them to be be there and that enzyme the the thing that the roundup destroys is in the beneficial bacteria it's in a lot of our gut microbiome there's a lot of life in our gut so all of this stuff that's sprayed on our food mm -hmm has destroyed our gut. And this is the reason for the disease that we see all of this stuff. Yeah. Like, like basically everything, this is the cure all. Exactly. So that it's a repair. Okay. We talk about nourishing, we talk about repair. And then uh, uh, this one, the super cleanser, it's what actually kills all the parasites in our gut. We all have parasites. If you wake up in the morning and you have inflammation in your face or in your gut, then you have parasites. If you um, feel bloated, if you wake up and you look shredded and muscular and towards the end of the day, you're bloated, then guess what? You have parasites because you have, got, you have inflammation. And these herbs will kill parasites. They're pretty strong. We only take them for 10 days, but it's amazing how you will feel after taking all these five superfoods. We have protein, vitamins and minerals, antioxidants, and prebiotics. And this is all the essentials that our body needs to thrive. And it's convenient. We ship everywhere, 100% organic. Our company goes way beyond organic standards. We've been fighting the organic um, companies for years because their standards are too low. The and we're, USDA. A yeah, the USDA. We're, we're a purist company. We test all of our superfoods 37 times from seed to package. We actually have an incredible machine which has a crystal and we test the cellular structure so let's say you have a cell of celery a fresh leaf of celery and then we have the hydrated celery we put it on the microscope with this crystal and we make sure that the cellular structure matches because we dehydrate our powders at room temperature below 115 degrees is considered raw and living so there, we have tons of people that are raw vegans, that they only eat raw foods, and they do consume the Purium superfoods because they're considered raw living. The cellular structure matches that of a living piece of celery. So I was like thrilled when I found this out. I said, you know what? This company totally aligns with my values and what I stand for in my communities and in the planet. I'm gonna start sharing this mission and that's over here. So, uh, I'm actually going to introduce somebody that I've known for a very long time. And uh, speaking of the gut brain, you know, the gut brain also makes you decipher between what's food, what's poison, and what's medicine. Okay, that's what our gut does. That's its actual job. If you watch an animal that lives in a forest, it knows automatically what food is. You know, if, it, if that animal became a human with a functioning gut brain, it wouldn't go to the store and eat any of the poison in the store because it has a functioning gut brain. Humans work the same way. We can turn our gut brain back on. And so uh, I'm actually going to have my mother share her experience. She just did this 30-day this alternate lifestyle transformation uh, about in, in November or December. And I went to her house in December. This is, I've never had organic stuff in my refrigerator my entire life this might be the reason why i actually got into health and fitness because i was sick i grew up with headaches i do use this as an example all the time when i used to give me i i was malnourished to a degree and and it wasn't her fault but it it drove me to want to find out about all this so i've never really promoted this stuff to my mom and i just sent her the stuff and I went to her house in December and there was like all organic stuff in the fridge. And I was like, hey, whose stuff is this? She's like, it's mine. And I'm like, oh yeah, that's right. You did the transformation. And so now it seems like she's wanting a lot of, a lot of healthy stuff in her, in her body. And that's what this does is it gives you your motivation to eat healthy things back. So mom, can you share your experience in like two minutes or under? Okay. Okay. Okay, I'll try to talk fast. Hi, everybody. Welcome. I'm Nino. 
Yay. <laughs> um, okay, so Ronnie got me started on the 40-day transformation. At the time, it was 40 days. And at first, I was leery. I didn't like the looks of the green shake. I thought I was going to puke when I first seen it. But I ended up liking it. I did the 40-day transformation. I followed the, the plans in there, like, to the T. After the 40-day, I lost a total of 16 pounds, which was my lost weight. It was my goal to lose that many pounds. So I asked Ronnie, how, what do I do after the 40-day transformation? He says, well, it's up to you. It's, it's up to you. It's your choice. So I chose to continue eating healthy, eating all organic. And till, since November, I've been still doing that. And I actually have people notice, even notice at my work, they notice my stress level has even gone down because I have a very stressful job. And I go into classrooms, well, at the time when we were still all open, go into classroom and a teacher, one teacher asked me, what's up with you? And I said, what about me? And she said, well, you normally come in here all stressed out, but today you seem like you're in a great mood. And so I really give credit to the Purium that got me to that point. Like I'm less stressful, I'm happy with my weight. And I love eating healthy and I'm trying to push it, you know, on my coworkers, on my friends. And at work, when we were going to work at the time, I would do my green shake and give everybody a shot, you know, and so I'm enjoying I've, that. Never, I've never had my mom share before, but mom, so I, my mother wasn't able to even drink water. That's how sort of, that's how her gut was operating. When I, you know, like she could drink about a cap full, like on top of a Pepsi container, a cap full of water and she would puke. My entire life, I've only seen my mother drink soda. So like, are you drinking water now? Last time I talked to you, that was like a huge thing. Yes, I'm drinking more water with that pineapple purium thingy that you add in the water. Yeah. I've been drinking so much of that. In fact, I've gone through my second order or third order of that already. All right, wow. great. Well, thank you for sharing. Awesome to hear that, actually, because, because you're doing it and I'm not asking you to. <laughs> yes, but I thank you for even getting me started. So, Awesome. Thank you, Minia. Thank you for sharing. And no uh, she's one of like hundreds of our people. And I could share some images uh, right here. Let me share my screen. Uh, this is is Jay and her transformation it's been amazing can you see her cabinet how she was full full of medication and she just kept going to doctors and doctors because she couldn't figure out what was wrong with her and now she switched to Purium and can you guys see her transformation right here can you see her picture it's incredible this was in 30 days and let me see if I can share um, one more screen because the transformations are happening left and right. Uh, you, can you guys see my screen? Yes. Can you see me scrolling through? Not now. Oh, okay. Let me find the picture. Okay, here we go. This is Melissa and she came to me about a month ago because she had a breast implant illness. Melissa, are you in the call? I don't think she's in the call. But yes, this is I am. Oh, Melly, can you share your, your, um, your transformation? Two minutes? Yes, of course. Um, so as Seema was explaining, I did have breast implant illness. I had implants for about five years. At the two year and a half mark, I decided to take them out because they were actually making me physically and mentally sick. Um, doctors couldn't really explain what was wrong with me. I had blood work done, ultrasounds done, and I never got answers. So I took it upon myself to do my own research and I concluded to take them out. And after taking them out, I did, feel, I did feel a lot better, but I still had food intolerances. And I always followed Seema, and I knew that she was in holistic healing. And I went to her, and I'm like, hey, look, like, this is what's going on. I need help. Can you please 
help me get my gut right. I'm sorry about my dog, by the way. <laughs> and she's like, yes, do, do the, you know, do the cleanse. We're going to repair your gut. And as you can see, and from day zero to day two, the inflammation went down. I'm, I was still the same weight. Everything was still the same. It was all inflammation. And from day zero to day 30, I only worked out about maybe a max of eight times. And I somehow gained muscle as well. And that's because I get obviously the amino acids. But yeah, I've been with, with you know, taking Purium products ever since. And I feel amazing. Mm -hmm. So guys, this isn't a weight loss program. So you noticed that she did gain muscle. My, my mother talks about losing 16 pounds. I have a friend in Michigan who lost 42 pounds in 30 days, but it's not a weight loss program. This is a health program. So we do have a lot of weight on us that's really unhealthy weight and or inflammation. And so we, we didn't even go into the inflammation reducing aspects. I'm going to leave that for another time. But this is a health program. Mm -hmm. It's just most people lose weight to be their most healthiest self. Exactly. Thank you, Melissa, for sharing. She actually gained color. When I met her, she was yellow because she was so acidic and poison with medications and everything that she went through in her implants and removing them, right? Antibiotics and everything else. So now she looks golden and beautiful. And like every time I see her Instagram, I'm like so full of happiness because she's just completely vibrating at a different frequency. We are what we eat. If we eat poor choices, we vibrate very low. So now we're going through this whole consciousness. So this whole awakening, right? The grand awakening is happening and it's here and it's all about raising our vibration. And food is one of the ways that we can bring more chi to our body, right? We can do it through our breath. We can do it through our food. And there's chi in our kidneys, you know, Qigong is a way to really raise that frequency in our kidneys. But this comes from our ancestors, from our traumas. Everything can affect this life force in our chi. So food is one of the main ways to raise your vibration. And with that being said, I want to talk a little bit about why I also joined this company. And we are a network marketing company as well. I was very interested in creating time and freedom in my life because as an architect that was practicing, I was working about 80 hours a week or more. I had no freedom in my life. I was a workaholic, always working with attorneys, land use attorneys, engineers, and all these people that were just so stressful. And I remember seeing Ra doing the cleanse, living his life, being at the beach, making money. And I was like, what are you doing? Like, I need to make money living my life as well. And I immediately got interested in the, in, the, in the opportunity financially because I wanted to cut my hours and have more freedom. So I joined Purium for their financial health because I was already doing the work of being healthy and teaching cooking classes and really allowing people to renegotiate their relationship with their building block materials, with their foods that I said, I'm in, I want to share the mission. I'm doing it anyways. I might as well get paid for. And I immediately started generating an income. I've been doing this for a year and a half and I quit my architecture practice. Now I am supporting this mission 100%. I am doing Purium all out. I replace my income and more, and I get paid to make a huge impact because when community change, so does our world. When our communities feel great, when all of you guys feel as the best version of yourself, guess what? You're going to start sharing with your families. You're going to start sharing because that feeling of amazingness has to be shared, right? This is why everyone that does fitness or feels good with their body, they take selfies and they put, put them on the Instagram because they feel good. And we want everyone to feel this feeling of being healthy. And corporate American can start to see the shift and this shift is permanent because it comes from a working consciousness. The all time of trading your time for money doesn't exist. We're in the new earth, we're the 2.0. We don't trade our time for money. 
anymore. I used to sit in my desk and make proposals for thousands of dollars and say, this is how much I'm going to charge you for 300 hours of my life. This is how much my time costs. Now we don't do that anymore. Now we're of impact. We run with purpose. We have a big mission. We have solutions with what people need. When we talk to people in the first five minutes, they're going to complain about their health or their finances. Guess what? We are problem solvers. We're so used to creating problems, having problems and passing them on, right? We have a problem and I pass it on to my boss and I pass it on to the manager. We pass it on to people. And then those problem solver people are the ones that get paid. Guess what? We have solutions. And this is what we're sharing with everyone because people like us, people that experience wellness, people like you guys that have done the transformation, there's no turning back. We aren't turning back. When you have a taste of what freedom feels like, what feeling well, what feeling healthy feels like, there's no turning back. And we have that responsibility. We have to become the change that we want to see in the world. If we want to see freedom in the world, we need to become free ourselves. If we want to see health in the planet, you need to become healthy. And this is how JJ Michaels says, he's here because he wants to experience heaven on earth. And it's our responsibility to become that change, to be that change, 100%. Be what you want to see. Be what you experience, what you want everyone to experience. And it's amazing because we're not here to convince anyone. I work for Elon Musk. I design uh, the Inspire Campus in Santa Monica. And he would say, we cannot change the world. So you got to give that up. No one can change anything, but we can inspire. And through inspiration, we allow people to discover their own transformations. And that's what we're standing for. She really, <laughs> she really did design the Inspire campus. So <laughs> she's like one of the best architects in America when she was doing it. Actually, the best architecture school gave her a free ride, and they don't do that for anyone because of her talent. So I'm just saying that so you guys get a, sort of an assessment that that was her reality. And for her, she was like, working for these people don't make me happy. Okay. Mm -hmm. And from an employee standpoint, network marketing can off, can be a shift for that. And same thing with the business owner. I was a business owner and actually I was doing some self-reflection just yesterday. And I was thinking to myself, I'm just going to mute whoever that was. And I was thinking to myself, wow, I've never done anything in my life that I didn't want to do. And that's actually not true. So my entire life, I've, I've, I've made my, I've created my own income. I've never had a full-time job that I relied on. And I was thinking, I've never done anything that I didn't want to do, but that's not true because when I owned my gyms, there was a feeling that I had every single day when I was looking at my employees and I was watching them go home with the amount of money that I paid them. And for me, that didn't feel good. And I know that many people are in jobs and or own businesses that aren't aligned to their values as people. And I speak a lot about vibration because our heart is an electromagnetic vibrator. It's resonating electromagnetic frequencies. If those frequencies are in line with you, with the logic, what you sense is correct and with your body and with your gut, if you are in line completely, then you actually have the power to transmute the physical reality around you because physical reality is no more than electromagnetic field itself. Mm -hmm. So a very strong, powerful, aligned person is important. And when I look into the, to the world, people need to be aligned. And if they're doing something every single day that they don't want to do, they don't like to do, and or they know is wrong, if that's a thing, they, they, is, they know is out of alignment to their self, then they're not being a very effective transmuter of reality. Mm -hmm. And so the Holistic Justice League is made to provide everybody the opportunity to be aligned with what they feel is important. And that's how awesome we are using this network marketing structure because in network marketing, our job essentially, when you join a network marketing company, your job is to develop yourself. And our job as leaders is, is to facilitate the development of the selves 
in the organization. And that's network marketing in a one sentence thing. You join, you learn how to enroll people in your vision. You learn how to speak in a connective, inspiring manner so that people are aligned. We have a product that's guaranteed to work. By the way, all the stuff we talked about, all the miraculous healings of these foods, it's not like hydroxy cut where there's chemicals in it. This is just foods. If they don't work to the level that we're saying it, anyone can return the empty containers to get their money back. So we basically have a product that every single person needs. Nobody can get this stuff anywhere else and it's guaranteed to work. We have the best product. This is like self-development 101 and we, are connecting with people and offering solutions to their problems. Everyone's inevitably gonna complain about their health or the amount of money that they make within five minutes. All we're doing is saying like, hey, I can show you a way, check this out. Mm -hmm. Come on this Zoom. Maybe some of you are on this Zoom to check it out right now. Go to this website, check out, check out what we're doing over here. And, and that's network marketing. And, and we're learning how to do these tasks. We eventually learn management skills, and then we eventually learn how to lead an organization and be responsible for many people's income by helping them be responsible for their organization. It's network marketing is really awesome when done correctly. Yeah. Seema, can I just ask a quick question, Seema? Yes. I just wanted to, uh, I want to tweet you because that was so good. You said, be what you want to see, and was it feel the way you want others to feel? What was the second part? Uh, be so the change that you want to see. Yeah. And feel the way that you want others to feel. I, I, think, Michael, no? I think it was something like that. Yeah, thank you. It was just really good. <laughs> thanks, Will. <laughs> hey, so just, just to, uh, Will, thanks for that. Just thank to uh, give a little bit of personal reference on what I'm saying, I'm going to bring on Michael Sedell. He's up in Canada. Actually, Will is in his organization, and Michael's one of our leaders. Uh, he's based out of Toronto, so we can do this anywhere in North America and and Europe. So that's Canada, U.S., and and many countries in Europe. So Michael, can you share in two minutes of just of your experience of doing this as a job, and maybe how that's progressed in your head about like how you've wrapped your head about network marketing and Purium and the Holistic Justice League mm -hmm. over the last like six months. Uh, hey everybody, it's Michael, and uh, you know, oh geez, I summarize it in six months. Well, you know what? I'm a power. I'm a, I'm a big believer in the power of love, and all that it uh, generates and uh, supplies us. So, um, my experience with this has been. I'm going to talk about it from a, a point of view of support. You come into an organization such as this, and uh, sometimes we come in and we think we have to do all these things by ourselves, and we don't. We are on a team that is innovative, supportive, uh, incredibly talented, and it comes from a place of love. And the interesting thing about love is the attributes of love are passion and desire and a wanting to move forward. So I started this journey thinking, huh, you know, I'm going to do this and make, you know, make a little money on the side. And it became much more than that. It became much more than that because of the sport that I was given through the team and the leadership of this team. And the two people you see on the screen are, are the big proponents of that. And um, I can't say that I've ever been in, in, involved in an organization that cares about their members, and I'm speaking specifically of the Holistic Justice League, and the support that they give them. So... Raw touched on something else. The most fascinating part of this as I've grown in this business and I've grown is that I learn more about myself every day and I learn more about other people. And that's priceless. I don't know if you could help. <laughs> Can you hear me? Did you hear yeah, me? Yeah, we got that, Michael. Thank you so much. I hope everyone could see Michael when he was talking. Um, well, I could see me. We, so, uh, we couldn't figure say. out how to do that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the most important part. So, um, so, yeah, it's been an incredible experience and it's an experience that I'm very passionate about and uh, really excited about taking to yet another level. And I'm not doing it by myself. I'm doing it with everybody. And that makes it so much more worthwhile. Right. Yeah. Right. And, and there's money involved, guys. And we're talking about business. Business, you know, we do, we do make basically however much money we want to make. And I say that for real. And, 
and we don't really talk about it right now at this stage because owning a business isn't about money. It's about the choice of responsibility. Mm -hmm. That's something that maybe everyone who owns a business will find out and maybe before you get to that point, you don't know. So we don't want to talk about the illusion of all the money that you make when you own a business because that money comes with responsibility. It's completely dependent on the ability for yourself to respond to the things that are presented in reality of a business owner. And so that's really why we're, but there is money, there is money and that conversation can be had. Yes. Can I add one thing there, Ralph? Yes. Sure. So uh, just um, maybe uh, sp speak on that point a little bit more specifically for in terms of my journey. When I began, Raw and Sima were the people who supported me and taught me how to begin to teach uh, and take care of the people on my team. And I've grown by their leadership. And so I'm now at a point where I'm taking the responsibilities of a leader and training my team. And again, just a fantastic journey. Mm -hmm. So those of you guys who will join, will get a checklist of things and on there will be a video and it's talking about this promotion that we do. It's the business transformation promotion where we can make a lot of money, tens of thousands of dollars. And it's, if you follow this program, there's somebody on here, Ant, I just wanna recognize because he joined three months ago and he essentially did everything that's possible for, for a business owner to do did I say three months or three weeks? It's three, three, weeks. three weeks ago. He did everything in three weeks to check off all of the bonuses. And the man made several thousands of dollars in his first three weeks. And it was an incredible job. And I just want to recognize him because all he did was follow the steps. We have steps. And this isn't the journey for everyone. Everyone has different intentions on what they want out of this. Some of us just want to get healthier. Some of us just want to share this. But for those of you who want to get in and actually make a career of this, it's, it's there for you. It's just dependent on your ability to be responsible and to develop yourself to the highest level of that. Yeah, so we always say you are in business for yourself, but you are never by yourself. We do everything as a team because when we come together, we can co-create a lot bigger. We do it as a collective. When you grow, we grow. So our responsibility is for you to grow so we can all grow together. And when I started, I had this negative connotation about network marketing, even though I didn't know anything about it because I never did it. I just was like, oh no, this pyramid scheme, I don't want to do it. And, and then I was like, you know what? I need to test it for myself. I got into the best schools in the world. I, I always felt that it wasn't for me until I tried it. And just like, and I found out this, you know, the way to success very fast because other people had already done it. There's already a roadmap on how to get there. It's just a matter of following the system, not reinventing the wheel. And it's been amazing to create with an awesome team because we say this is a personal development course with a compensation plan. We care less about selling. This is about sharing transformations, people healing their bodies, people he healing their finances because financial health is something that doesn't get seen enough. And the reality is that people don't buy organic because they don't have the resources because it's too expensive. So they opt for the non-organic, the one that's causing their diseases because that's what they can afford. So having extra $500 only for your groceries or having an extra 2000 so you can upgrade your car and get an, an electric car or whatever it is, we're here to solve that problem and we can do it. And we do it by being the best version of ourselves. We do it by becoming objections and limiting beliefs because we have to do the inner work. And as we do this inner work for transformation, this is how we get compensated. So we literally get paid to be amazing. We get paid so I can learn that that's a limiting belief that I'm running that I'm not worthy and that I'm not good enough and that I have to change my thoughts in my reality about my finances. I get paid to do that work. So it's awesome. And I feel that right now, network marketing is the future of 
the economy because we have a home-based business. Ron, myself. And everyone's at home right now. Yes. See what we're saying? This is all coming for full circle now to the present moment. Yes. There is no future, guys. What we have is now and everybody's at home. So mm -hmm. when we're thinking about what's going to happen when the virus thing clears, no, 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 no. Like that reality actually doesn't exist. What we have is now. So we want to be present in the moment. What are we doing now? And so thank you guys for listening to what we are creating, what <laughs> everybody in our community is doing mm -hmm. now. And if you got invited here, uh, please, you know, reach out to the person that invited you. Should we do questions right now? Yes. If you have, if you have any questions, please feel free to unmute yourself. We did and cover a lot. Yes. All right. If there's no questions. Someone. We heard of Hi. Her. Hi. Um, Super muscle. Hi. My, um, <laughs> my name's Connor. I'm from Vancouver. Um, I just got to meet Cyber Meet with the Michael that just spoke. Oh, uh, awesome. I hope I'm not rude to you. I'm on. I'm in lying down. But is that okay? No. <laughs> yeah, I'm from Vancouver. I actually just purchased the program uh, as ambassador, so I'm, I'm excited to be part of the team. And I can see and feel you guys just so excited and, and rejuvenating you know, your your power and just. Uh, just so uh, amazing to f see and feel uh, what I'm going to be a part of your team. So I'm, I'm thank you for what you do. And then uh, I'm so stoked to be a part of your team and uh, heal the world pretty much. Thank you. Thank you for receiving yeah. and for being open yeah. to receiving yeah, because that's something yeah. that most of us have to work on, on receiving, right? Yeah. A lot of us I'm are just both. givers and givers. <laughs> yeah. So true. Yeah. So I heard everything you said. I can like 100% agree what you say from my heart. So I'm very thankful for, you know, there's not a lot of people like you guys out there, right? So we need more of you and keep doing what you're doing and thank you for it just being awesome. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well, we, we all on this call are what you're speaking of. This, yes. like we are the lucky ones. We are in the know. And it yeah. really is because of that, our responsibility mm -hmm. to make sure that everyone in our network at least knows what we have to offer for them. We want to stand up as our fullest self and present solutions to maybe things that, that everybody's concerned with. And we've, yeah, we've got, we've got solutions. We're the solution people. So yeah. 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 Well, thank you so much for sharing. Yeah, we can, I can feel that. And then and when someone start like actually embodying the, the true inner self, which is so hard to see these days, right? So it just kind of cheered me up in a way. Oh my God, there are people out there. I just got to find them. Hey, <laughs> and uh, thank God, uh, yeah. Super muscle. One day you're going to look around and you're going to realize everybody around you is vibrating high. And yeah. then you really, like when I talk about transmuting reality and then yeah. the, 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 the language of most people aren't like this, that won't exist anymore. You'll be in a different place. You'll yeah, see... Yeah different reality and that's going to be an awesome transition for you yeah thank you yeah. <laughs> yeah your personality is determined by your personal reality so oh, when your personal okay. reality changes okay. so will your personality that's why everyone is just experiencing happiness and wellness and abundance because your personal reality will determine your personality and Did how you, make you project that up or? <laughs> No, I got it from it's, Joe it's, Dispenza. It's in the words, guys. You can look it's at the Joe words. Joe Dispenza. <laughs> <laughs> oh, All right, everybody. Well, I know it's like after 11 on the East Coast. Thank you all so much for being here, for being present with us, for sharing time and digital space with us. Uh, we will be this, and let's all stay connected. Somehow, let's make it happen. Let's, you know, this is the future. This is the network, right? The ascension requires the network of people to harmonize. Yeah. So we're going to sign off. Actually, I'm going to unmute you all. If you want to say something. Thank you. We love Thank you guys. You. Thank, Thank you. you. Love. Love Lots you. of love. Thank you. Later. Have a Lots good night. Have a good night. Have a good night. Bye. Love you. Bye. Bye. Love, 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 love. Bye. 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 Bye
Tonto, what happened the last two days? Love, 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 love. Jessica, you too. I'm waiting. I'm waiting to see what's up. I got it all. All right. Who's that, brother? Hi. Hi. Hi, everyone. Oh, look at that. Someone wrote a heart on the screen. Maxine. What? Is that the heart or is uh, it just the surface? Yeah. It looks like <laughs> Paper. I have no. awesome dreams tonight with this good energy. <laughs> oh, it's toilet paper. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> sending love. Peace out. Bye. Bye, Michael. Thank you. See you sharing. all. All right. Bye, Lulu. <laughs> See you later, guys. Oh. Have a great night. Adios. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Hey, Finn, thank you for being here. Thank you.